guys, uh, my name is Felix and I'm an Egyptologist. Just came back from Egypt. It was amazing. So I'm going to show you my research on the god Horus. Horus was a god that was very famous in ancient Egyptian times. He was most known for his eye. Sounds weird, but the eye of Horus was used whenever someone died. They would carve his eye on the coffin that the dead person would lay in. Well, when mummified, the Egyptians would wait 40 days to carve his eye on their bones. The Eye of Horus is an ancient Egyptian symbol of protection, royal power, and good wealth. What did Horus look like? He looked like a half hawk, half man. His, his head was a hawk and his body was a man. Um, who was he related to? His mother, his mother was the god Isis and his dad was Osiris. His grandmother was called Nut and grandfather was called Geb. In the ancient Roman times, Isis and Horus were considered equals. How did Horus come to life? Horus came to life when Isis lost her husband and brother in, by the evil Seth. After the incident, Horus was created by magic. Then, when Horus grew up, would challenge Seth in, what, in, one to ten, in many fights. And in one of those fights, he actually lost his eye. And that's where the eye of Horus comes from. Okay, so that so that's my research so far in ancient Egypt. So bye guys!